All right, welcome back to the channel. It's Sam here with GSK Wealth Builders, and today we'll be bringing you uh, an information on a trick that I've been using for uh, new crypto coins that don't really have much statistics on them. And it will save you a lot of time so you don't have to go through white papers um, and you'll get a little bit of information on the crypto coin and where you're buying it, what's it what its valuation is. So today I'm gonna be talking about moon sheets. So moon sheets is uh, just a new, it's just a quick tri trick that I use to find the value of a new coin that is on the market. For example, a coin that is on the market for two days and you see it's pumped 90%, you wanna know what the value of it is relative to all the other coins in its space. So a moon sheet is just a quick search where you can figure out uh, this value. So let's go through the presentation. All right, so a moon sheet is a community made cheat sheet that compares the returns of a coin and the market cap of a coin to the IDO price. So an IDO is, for those of you that don't know, it's the individual or initial decentralized offering. So it's the same as like an IPO in stocks, but except it's on a decentralized platform. So the advantages of a moon sheet is one, it saves time. So you don't have to go reading white papers to find out what the circulating supply is. Usually the circulating supply on CoinGecko and CoinMarketCap is not accurate in the first couple months, even the first year. And then uh, the second thing, the advantage is it's open source. So uh, you can just find it through other people in the community. And usually there's you'll find a certain amount of people. Like you follow five or six people on Twitter and they, they provide you all of the moon sheets on the new coins. Mm -hmm. The disadvantage of the moon sheet, there's no due diligence attached to it. So you can still find out what a crypto is and think it's undervalued, but you need to do your own due diligence, researching the team, researching the, the code, what the use case is, how far they are, the timeline, can they execute all of those things? Are they backed? And then of course, uh, the accuracy, the moon sheet could be completely wrong. So where to find moon sheets? So I find moon sheets on Twitter. I'll just go on Twitter and I'll search, for example, uh, convergence moon sheet or um, you know polka starter moon sheet. And then usually I'll click on the images or media. And then once I go through media, you can scroll through. The second place is just you know Telegram groups. People will post them in the Telegram groups. So this is an example of a moon sheet here. So this one is a convergence finance moon sheet. So let's just go through the information that they show you. So they show you on this moon sheet, the public sale price. They show you the initial market cap at the IDO. So it was worth $2.2 .2 million at the IDO, where it's for sale, the start time, and the, the time that it's been, gonna be traded on decentralized exchanges. And then they also have their information. So you can go to coin alerts, you can join their telegram, or follow them on Twitter. I really don't follow them because you just get spam. But uh, when I need to search for a coin, that's what I do. But then it shows what's going to happen. So if there's a one x return, the market cap. Well, I guess one x is just zero. So two point two million dollars. When there's a five x return, which would be zero point zero two five, so two and a half cents, it's gonna be at eleven million dollars. That's actually where I'm trying to buy convergence. At a 10x return, we're at five cents, twenty-two million dollars. That's basically what we're at right now at convergence and what the date was March. So who knows if there's gonna be another dip, but if you buy convergence today around five cents, that's what it's worth, about twenty-two million dollars. And then if it does a hundred X from the original price, it would be at fifty cents. So what this does is you can buy. So when someone says, I need a 100x return, it sounds crazy. Well, all you had to do is buy at the very first day or on a dip, right? And then just wait until it gets to a regular decent market cap with growth and uh, execution. So for a finance or DeFi protocol to hit 200 million <clears throat> in a bull run, that's pretty, that's pretty easy as long as they're hitting all of their hitting all of their targets and they're getting user um, usage on their platform. So that is what a moon sheet looks like. And then let's see what another moon sheet looks like. So this is a completely different person, uh, a Solana version moon sheet. So this coin is called Media Network and it shows the IDO, the time, the original price was $10. The market cap was $1 million, right? So 
um, media network I believe it's what $15 right now let's see Wow Wow okay so media network is 72 dollars and 29 cents so then you go on here at, wow it was actually 186 dollars so it's been dipping but as you can see right there's no market cap so they just don't have the information so then you could go search for the moon sheet and find that information so now you go here so let's see where 70 dollars falls so 70 dollars is 7x return and it's worth seven million dollars right now so it's still pretty small but 7x return so that's why it did hit what 180 so it was worth 15 million and now it's down so you can see at 100x it would be worth a thousand dollars per coin which at 180 you know they were almost there on the first day so if they do what they say they're going to do and they progress you can see it so for me i'm like okay what do i want to do i want to get the coin really cheap I want to get it down here between 1 and 5x and then uh, I know so I know that I need to be buying if this ever happens right between 10 and 50 dollars if I buy between 10 and 50 dollars say I bought at 30 dollars right that's a 3x so that means 100x is going to be around a 33x for me because I'm buying too expensive if I'm able to get it at 10 dollars which would be really hard to find um, that price then you know when you get back up to the hundred million dollar market cap you're laughing so uh, that is what a moon sheet is so that basically wraps it up um you know that's the summary of what is a moon sheet and as you can see a moon sheet is just a piece of um piece of calculations designed by someone in crypto and hopefully their information is accurate but it can just help you be a guide so when you buy okay where are we at three hundred dollars thirty million dollar market cap right so now I'll just show you how I would find the moon sheet so you would go to search and you would type um, what coin do I want to search I want to search DFYN moon sheet and there we go somebody posted a dfyn moon sheet so it's around four dollars right now so it's it's 50x so you got to think about that so this also gives you some insight right so if a coin is at 50x the original price if someone you know vc investor put a million dollars in at 1x and then he gets to 50x he doesn't have 50 million dollars so if he dumps like 10 percent of his portfolio it's 10 million dollars that's a huge dump on the market right so um <laughs> well he probably couldn't have put a million dollars at that now, he couldn't have put a million dollars at 1x but you know what i mean if he has a large chunk of his portfolio he's going to want to de-risk that portfolio and move it into other places so it just shows you that certain um x returns you're going to have ma massive dumps so you're going to have a dump at you know 25x 50x 100x but then it's going to continue to go up if it keeps going so that's just sums it up so that's the moon sheet and uh yeah i'll be bringing more tips as uh we, as always we have new content weekly so please subscribe please like the channel and turn your notifications on Follow me on Twitter because that's usually what I post. And then if you want to find the best deals that I, f I have found in crypto right now, it's uh, gskwealthbuilders.com slash gifts. And that's where you're going to be able to find the, the best deals. So thank you very much. And uh, I'll have a new video out soon.